Joanne here from New Zealand. This morning I'm going to be making a bauble, this one here. I'm going to do a variation on this one. This one has a stripe through the middle. I'm just going to do a plain one. And you're only going to need two pieces to make this. And uh, the two pieces you need are a circle and the little hanging part on the top. So the first thing you're going to do is, is actually just stitch this across the bottom there. I'm going, because I'm using buttons to decorate it, I'm going to reinforce it with a bit of fusible um, interfa woven interfacing. So the first thing I'm going to do is iron the fusible interfacing on and then I will stitch just the bottom half of that on. Here it is stitched on. The next thing to do is to sew on your buttons. Now I'm using four totally different stars as you can see and I'm going to stitch those on probably with a little bit of yellow thread I'll stitch those on once you've stitched those on the next thing to do is to sew your velcro on the back of your piece of backing felt so what I do is I position this on and then I make sure that I position the velcro on the back of that centrally and um, take that away, sew the velcro on and then once all the buttons are stitched on here I'll put that on and I'll just stitch round the outside and including the little catch at the top there. Now I've already made a couple of these before using some of these big buttons on um, one of them and it's actually not a problem uh, having that bulk and as you can see some of those buttons are actually quite thick just be careful when you're placing those buttons that you actually leave enough room for your needle to on your sewing machine to stitch around the edge and uh, once I've done that then I will get my sharp micro uh, micro tip fiskers scissors these are the ones I love to use and I will cut round the outside and uh, that will all be finished here's the finished wee bauble everything has been stitched on with yellow thread and then I've sewn around the the outside close to the edges and it's all finished and looking fabulous hope you enjoy making your baubles